I'm here to talk about the nature of SA REITs, the, the nature relating to its defensive capabilities, its sustainable growth capabilities, and generally the nature of REITs in relation to, to other investments. The REITs are a, an unusual investment from a stock exchange point of view in terms of its distribution nature. The, the REITs distribute at least 75% of its uh, distributable earnings and that forms part of its, its structure of the company. And really what we're saying to the general public is REITs are an investment that provides you with sustainable growth going forward. These are companies that are regulated by the Johannesburg Stock Exchange. These are companies that report twice a year. They audited companies. And these are companies that are run by professionals who've been in the property business for a long time, uh, people who have uh, vast knowledge of the property industry and really what we're there for is to provide this this long-term income based on leases some of them very long leases generally with good escalations and this is escalations on the annual rentals of, of anywhere between six and a half and in some cases ten percent escalations some of them like the retail properties have uh, turnover clauses but this is properties that are well looked after, properties that increase in value every year. These are properties that have um, income that is uh, predictable well into the future. You know what you're investing in. The, the shopping centers, if there are shopping centers, are generally buildings that you visit on a day-to-day -day basis um, to, to buy your household goods, your shopping centers, anchored by the, the, the likes of all the majors. These are also office blocks where um, the vast majority of the buildings are CBD and, um, and major uh, nodal locations and then large industrial properties. That's generally the, the um, type of properties that the companies invest in and really what we're saying is, is that these are the type of properties that provide income that you can predict long into the future. At the moment, the companies are providing anywhere between 7.5% and 12%, uh, but probably on average 8% growth per annum. Historically, they've provided those type of incomes, and generally for the next year, at least the companies are providing the same type of, of, of incomes. Mm -hmm.